Hey, 大家好，誒，我係多華會嘅會長鄭永倫。咁咧，我哋今晚係誒喺呢一度咧，我哋就慶祝我哋嘅多華會成立二四十週年啦。咁誒，今晚咧就大概有二百幾個嘉賓會出席啦。咁誒，我哋喺今晚咧就會誒有一個誒國會議員嘅分章咧，就會頒俾我哋嗰啲會董同埋我哋嘅社區嘅領袖咁樣誒嚟慶祝嘅嚇。過去咧就誒四十年嚟咧就我哋多華會咧就由喺唐人街嘅一個小小嘅機構，咁咧就係由誒幾位熱心嘅誒 volunteer 啦，咁就誒發起嘅。到今年四十年啦，咁我哋咧就喺多華會咧就係服服務呢啲新移民咧，就誒喺新移民嘅社區都有四十年。咁咧就係誒，而家我哋咧就包括咗有六十個誒職員啦，咁就另外咧就有誒四個中心啦，喺多倫多大多市入邊有四個中心，咁誒嚟誒對我哋嘅新移民嘅服務。誒，各位記者朋友，我開多一圍俾你哋嚇，一間炒松啲，係㗎，我多級多多級啲書。On behalf of the Cross Cultural Community Service Association, I would like to welcome everyone to our 40th anniversary celebration. TCCSA is a charitable organization that has served the immigrants community since 1973. I will, I will lend you the flags. I'll get the flagpoles back, okay? There you go. It's a pleasure to be here tonight with you and celebrate the 40 years. I'm sure that we will have more conversations throughout the night. And there's some people that we're honoring tonight. <coughs> and I want to tell you a little bit about that, if I may. Um, I want to recognize uh, Nelson. Thank you for, for making me, inviting me to be part of uh, tonight. Nelson, is, yourself and your wife are, are great individuals. And I know that there's a good friend of mine, Frankie. Where'd Frankie go? There you go, stretching the hand in the back. So these two great individuals along with Elliot have been friends for a long time. And for me, that's a treasure. You know that when they say when you have good friends, you don't need no enemies? Well, I've got a lot of good friends. And uh, I want to thank them for making my life a little easier. Um, last weekend, we celebrated uh, 25 years of my election. And tonight, we're going to celebrate 40 years of your birthday. So, happy birthday. But what we're going to do tonight later on, I'm going to be called back up. Or are we going to do some now? Or later? Later, okay. There's 40 people that have been nominated and have qualified to receive the Silver Jubilee Medal for Scarborough Age Accord. We um, struck a medal in order to celebrate the riding, not me. Although I happen to be the only member of Parliament for Scarborough Age Accord, that can change very easily. 
but the writing of Scarlet Rachel Bird was founded 40 years ago. Before that, before 1988, north of the 401, north of Ellesmere, it used to go from the Don Valley all the way out to Pickering. And then Elections Canada decided that there's enough people living up here and they divided the area. The area has somehow small, you know, just slightly changed, but the core area is still there. So it goes from Victoria Park, Steeles, Midland, and a little bit over to Primley and the 401. Before that, it used to go south of the 401, but in the new election, it will go up to Midland. So it's been my delight and my pleasure to be the member of Parliament. And I want to thank you. I know a lot of you were at the celebration last week. It dragged on a bit. But tonight, I think we're here to celebrate 40 years of TCCSA. The work that they've done. The hard work that they've done. I've been with them to China a number of times. I've been at their openings. And i got to tell you, folks, if there was an organization, a volunteer NGO organization, that's to be treasured, that it's to be congratulated, and to be celebrated, there's none else than TCCSA. Now, I know that... I can promise you one thing, and one thing only, that we're going to strive to do better. And um, in the future, after governments change, we're going to get you more money. Maybe. For sure. We'll see. Folks, thanks for having me. Enjoy the evening. And uh, you guys don't smile tonight. On behalf of Scotiabank, as you heard from the previous speaker, uh, Scotiabank has been a title sponsor for TCCSA's pre-settlement workshop in China. And I was honored to spend some time with them in the last two years, together with Jim. And it was a great trip because I can see a lot of immigrants or people planning to move to Canada. They were so looking forward to the pre-settlement workshop. And I really applaud Elliot and particularly Nelson and the whole board of TCCSA, your delegation and your loyalty to helping the newcomers to, have, to learn what Canada is all about. They're not only the ambassador for TCCSA, but also the ambassador for Canada. And I'm particularly happy to be their partner. Today, um, I also want to take this moment to recognize Jim. Jim has been a great leader in our community. And he always have a soft spot for the Chinese community because he actually lead the whole Scarborough area. And when I go to China, I can see him speak passionately, helping the newcomer from China to settle in any part of Canada. So all the best to you, Jim, and thank you so much. And last but not least, I want to speak on behalf of the recipients of the medal tonight. Friends and family, without your support, without your recognitions and your caring and your company, we won't be here today to receive the medal. So the glory is not only to the recipients, but to every one of you. So thank you and hope you enjoy the evening. Thank you. And Mr. President, for uh, having me here. I'm back. My name is Han Dong. I'm, uh, I'm here on behalf of uh, the Honorable Michael Koto, Ontario Minister for Citizenship and Immigration, which I think is a partner to uh, TCCSA to provide very valuable settlement service for a lot of newcomers um, in the uh, in the area. And um, you know, I, I know TCCSA does very good work. Uh, in, in, in downtown, in downtown Scarborough, and uh, up in Northern Richmond Hill as well. Oh, I'm sorry. And uh, I, my first encounter with uh, TCCSA uh, was uh, when my colleague was the minister. He announced a quarter million dollars uh, to start a language training program uh, with the uh, Scarborough branch. So here I am. Uh, just want to read a uh, quickly read a greeting from the minister himself. From the Minister of Citizenship Immigration on the, on the occasion of 40th anniversary celebration dinner, it is my pleasure to extend warm greetings to everyone attending the Cross Culture Community Service Association. Our government, and I think you did a fantastic job. And, you know, uh, let's uh, put our hands together for our team.
How many is the owner of four swings?